Today we're going to draw this um, bee and I'm going to show you uh, how we do it step by step. Um, here is the first step. Remember, we are doing this cross and this line doesn't need to be like perfectly straight, but I want you to have the cross so you know how to place these two circles and how big the circle is going to be. And the distance is very important because if you put too close, the bee's body is going to be very short. You put too far, this bee's body is going to be too long. Okay, so um, that's why after you draw this circle, then you draw the second one, you look at it and say, okay, how far this circle to this circle is about, that's the distance, right? And the circle is lower than that circle. You can tell by, you know, this is up to this line. This is like down to this center line, right? Okay, that's the first step. After the first step, so you kind of connect the top, that's the body, and make sure you find the right place. Don't start here or don't start here, right? You look at it, okay? You look, okay, it's about the center here. Then the ends right here is a little bit the top, but it didn't end center here, right? Just have to look around. After that, you do the the arm, that's the body, that's the leg. The leg can, you're going to be a little bit hard, but you can do like this. Okay, one more time. You can do the top first, then you add the feet, all right? And try that. And after this, then you put two wings on top then after the wing you put the face and you start the flower flower you start from here the center right then start from this one you get this one right then you get this one right then you start start here finish here let's start where we'll start here this one start here see you can get one by one, get it done. Um, that's the fourth step, I think. Then fifth, then you add another flower here. You make the flower more detailed, see the little bit curved. And if you don't want to curve it, it's fine. If you want to just draw like, like this, it's fine. It doesn't have that curve and it's good too and after that that's the final step so i add lots of detail see lots of details and the wrinkle on the flower and the thumb on the back now that's the uh, last one the shading one um i mixed color in there i didn't use one color I used uh, this red with purple, this dark uh, green with a light yellow bit green, and this is a, I mix yellow with orange. So try to try to mix color. Uh, looks better. Okay.